Andy Stevenson for Severe MMA, joined alongside the new Premier FC lightweight champion, Mario Di Tofano. How are you feeling after that victory over Solomon Simon? Good, mate, good. Uh, I wanted to go out and prove I was the best amateur in the country today, and I did that. So I'm fucking buzzing. Yeah. How do you feel about the fight overall? Um, I think he was good, with, he was good defending the takedowns. Um, he got me down in the first. Um, so I was like, fuck, but I just had to keep the composure and keep going. I think I need to, I need to believe in my hands a bit more and let them go because the range was nice. I could have landed a few more kicks if I committed to it, but I, I don't know the confidence wasn't in the hands. But like everyone tells me, I have good hands and I don't fucking throw them. You know what I mean? So I need to go back and work on that. Yeah, you know, a lot, a lot of the fight it was very back and forth, both on the yeah. feet up against the cage. What were you expecting coming into it? <sighs> that I was expecting a good high-paced. Uh, mixed martial arts bout, like, you know what I mean? I knew I wasn't just going to be able to go in and double leg him. I knew I had to play the game, setups, um, big cage, and I was looking forward to it. I said that on the end of the show, I was looking forward to a good fight wherever it went, and I'm really happy that I got, I got to give a good showing to myself tonight. Yeah, as you mentioned, you know, a nine meter diameter cage, the biggest in Ireland from what I'm told. Um, did that affect anything kind of coming in? Like, does that affect your game plan when you're fighting in that bigger cage? No, not at all. I train the big cage in HQ. That's why we do fight simulations in that. So if anything, that suited me more. Um, I don't even know if they have a cage or what's the story, but I'm well used to that. So that was grand for me. Yeah, you know, 6-0 and now as an amateur. Uh, you're on a great run at the moment. What's next for you? Um, I'm actually fighting in the UK next. Um, I didn't want to announce it, obviously, because I was focused on this, but that's signed. I'm fighting uh, Shock and Awe, Charlie Hatton for the lightweight belt over there, going over to Portsmouth. So hopefully all goes well. I get that fourth belt and then uh, have to give that fucking dope Dennis Fringpong uh, a go. You heard me, Dennis. You're a dope. You spend more time with the apology than you do in training. So, okay, let's, let's talk about Dennis. Yeah. You know, I interviewed him after the Euro show. He called SPG a bunch of rats. Yeah. Uh, did you feel like that was directed towards you? Yeah, yeah. And you know what's embarrassing about that? He apologised to me after. He messaged me. You know what I mean? He went on talking about that and he apologised in, in my DMs. I have the DM saying, ah, it's nothing really against you, mate. It's just the hierarchy of SPG. I was like, mate, embarrassing. You know what I mean? He knows I have something on him. I ha you know, Dennis, you're calling me a rat. You're a scumbag. You know that. Right, well, I think, I think we're going to have to get this fight going because yeah, uh, there's only one way to kind of settle this. I wouldn't even mind doing it. A pro, Dennis, so I can elbow you and slice you open. How about that? Next year, pro, mate. Let's do it. When do you want to go pro? You know, 6-0 now as an amateur? You I don't know, good I don't know. I'm going to see how the next one goes um, against Charlie Hatton and see what happens there. If I feel like, I, obviously I was in there, I didn't get to see it from a third eye, third eye view, but I'm going to have a look back and see how well I looked in. How do you think I looked against Solomon? I thought it was a great fight from both Did of you, I to be honest. Right? You, you look pretty good. Okay, well then, well then, hopefully see what Charlie Hatton has to say and then I'll have a look at that and... Maybe talk to John and Dave, we'll see, I don't know. It's all, yeah, I'm getting there slowly but surely. Well, congratulations on the win. Mario Di Tofano, the new Premier FC amateur lightweight champion. Congratulations, and we'll see you again. Thank you, appreciate it, mate. Cheers.